What's up everyone? Welcome to a brand new movie review and I'm gonna tell you guys I'm not sleeping tonight. Neither am I, Zach. And trust me, if you see this film, neither will you. Hereditary is the brand new A24 horror film, psychological horror film in some senses, and psychological just fucked up film in general. Um, this is Cody. He's back yep. reviewing another film with me. Hey guys. And let's talk. Um, this is the most disturbing and unsettling film I've ever seen in my life. Absolutely. No, I, I was talking to Zach after we got out of the movie theater and saying the film that disturbed me the most and actually gave me the most nightmares after getting out of it before this film was sinister, but Hereditary absolutely takes the cake. I mean, I have never seen a film that goes as disturbing as this film does and as scary and terrifying as it does but the nice part about it is with all the horror elements that are in it that work so effectively it's also a really great story about family as well yeah i'll go i'll one up that and say the same thing as you um i i really have no, the, the reaction you see from my face is like our pure reaction and same within the thumbnail that this film is unsettling it's scary, and it takes a lot to scare me. There's not a lot of horror films out there that really terrify me where I'm not going to be able to sleep. No, this film, it got to the point in this film where I was genuinely not wanting to watch the film anymore. I was genuinely scared. The story engrossed me. I was into the story, but overall, it got to the point where I wanted to stop watching it because this film is terrifying. It is a horror lover's dream. And you know, The Witch right back here, this is the other A24 film horror film that I feel like a lot of people do know. This is The Witch, but times 10, in my opinion. I, I think a lot of it works in different kind of ways. No, you're absolutely right. There's so, From the performances to the overall tone of the Tony film. Tony Collette was fantastic. Yeah, Oscar-worthy performance from Tony Collette. And yeah. um, Alex Wolf or Nat Wolf? One of the two Naked Brother bands fantastic everyone yeah. in here is great yeah no all, all the performances are fantastic and it it works so effectively because right from the very beginning you're on these character side and you feel for them and you worry for them and you you want to see where they're going and one of the highlights of this film that zach and i noted not only that the fact that the film as a whole performances story-wise is great, but the cinematography yeah. as a whole was fantastic it's very special just know everything that you see ties in some way shape or form i went in this film not even seeing the trailer and i heard the cinematography who said i i you know going into this film we both heard that this film is the scariest film of the years yeah and one of the most unsettling one of the most disturbing films and it lives up to that hype i i don't think that's ever been that where i've no. actually gone in with you know i heard that about it mm. it was not that scary to me uh, i heard that about the conjuring films they are scary but they're nothing that stay with me this film is just staying, staying with me i'm thinking and replaying images in my head and overall i think you and me are trying to stay very vague about this because this is a film you don't want to know much about no absolutely and uh, right off the top if you guys couldn't tell this movie is not going to be for everybody no. it's very unsettling if it's you... very disturbing are into horror films, you're going to love this film. If you get scared easily, I think you should be a little bit more prepared or maybe not even see it. Absolutely. Because it's terrifying. Like, it terrified me, and there was people in our audience that actually left, and I never saw them come back. Absolutely. And, you know, it's actually quite funny because, like Zach, when it comes to the marketing for horror films, A24 or whatever, whenever they say this is the scariest movie that's been in recent it. memory, it you know, it. this time, it, it, Zach's right. It does mean it. I mean, they said the same thing with The Witch. I don't necessarily believe that about The Witch. This film... This film hits is... all the marks for a horror film. It it had a fantastic story, wonderful performances, knocked everything out of the park. The directing by Arid Ashad, I think that's how you say him, fantastic. He crafted one of the best horror films in years, oh. if not even one of the scariest. It's hard to watch again. Yeah, I, it's disturbing. It's unsettling. It's everything you want in a horror film and more. And I think A twenty four nailed it, grabbing this film from the festivals. I don't know what else to say about this film. This film is a masterpiece of horror. I This is going to become a horror classic. I, I don't see it any other way, shape, or form. No, this is going to be a horror film that people are going to remember for years to come. And one of the notable reasons, like with The Witch, like any other great horror film out there, is you got to remember, guys, one of the biggest things that makes a horror movie work is the score. And the score, and the score is great. And the score in Hereditary is... The sound design, the sound yeah. mixing, everything adds to make what a great horror film is. I'll put it this way. This is, you know, back then The Exorcist was hailed as one of the scariest films of all time. I don't think it's that scary. 
Um, neither do you really. It, no. But at the time, I know that film was scary. Hereditary is the exorcist of this generation, of this decade, whatever you want to call it. That is what Hereditary is. I have no doubt in my mind. So with all it said, again, we both said this is a masterpiece of horror. Yep. And we're going to give Hereditary an A+. plus. Tell me, guys, what did you guys think about Hereditary? Are you guys excited about this film? Are you terrified now after seeing this review? Trust me, it is a scary film. Be prepared. But I can't wait to talk with you guys about this film. So make sure to comment down below. Me and Cody will both be looking through the comments, talking with you guys about how great this film is. But also, if you're new here, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. And also, go hit over to Cody Curtis's channel. Tell them where they can find you at. Absolutely, guys. Besides being terrified on this channel after seeing Hereditary, you can find me at Cody Curtis. Just search that name. It should be the first name that pops up in the YouTube search bar. You can also find me on Twitter and Instagram if you just search underscore Cody underscore Curtis. I'm happy to talk with you guys and I'm happy to have a great conversation about movies. Yep, go hit him up guys. Trust me, if you like me, you're gonna like him. If you haven't seen him before on my channel, I don't know how. If you're watching this on Sandwich on Films, you've probably seen him review Nostalgia. Yes, we like to bring up that film because he had such a fun time watching it. Oh, but let me tell you guys, also, if you guys want to talk more geeky stuff with me, go hit up all my social media links down below. And, of course, I already mentioned Sandwich on Films. If you have not checked out the website, you can find it down below as well right there. You can win advanced movie screens, movie news, and movie reviews. Trust me, you're going to want to check it out. And without further ado, man, I want to put it this way. If you guys want to see a spoiler review for this, me and Cody will be full down to do a spoiler review. So comment down below and tell us if you guys want that. Until next time, guys, don't get scared.